Might need a little bit more magic damage to deal with the Naga, but I mean, remember when Primal was first released, the big thrum. And even just a little bit of that regen as well underneath the tower. He had a Tango going at the same time as well. I think he wants to just push this wave under. He's, he's gonna go for the dive! He's got the kill! Wow! I mean, relatively strong lane of a CM and a Sven has yet to net them a kill. He's actually gone back the other way. Yeah, the docks here falls. You my yeah, a great addition to my god. Ten minutes, and he should start to pop off eventually on the dark scene. Looks like he's starting to go towards a few of those uh, aura items that I was talking about. The veil, for starters, into the uh, the mech. Well, Antares, Frostbite. One more physical attack should do it. And there it is. Gets the kill onto Scarif, but in return, Mars finds a kill onto one of the supports as well. Takes down Crystal Maiden. So See now, the level 6 on Erase. If they wanted to make a play around this mid lane, they absolutely could. Yeah, you can see Azdekor, he's made the TP in. You've got Rubik playing around this sort of area as well in solo. Well, he's been able to secure the Amplify damage room, but might not get away with his life now. Ooh! He'll be fine. Okay, that's okay. I mean, no silence here on Antares. Two points into concussive shot. Poor Azdekor. And Spark Wraith finds Azdekor. Meanwhile, though, they will push Antares into the Tier 1 tower. Very close to death there, but in return, Erase will fall along with Rue here as well with the Spark Race triple kill for Kiyotaka on the middle lane. Perfect the way that he's been playing this Mars. He's been looking to emphasize a little bit more into... Oh, TP going up top. They feel like they can get a kill, perhaps, onto the Darkseer. Oh, there's the silence. Yep, that is a definite kill. Leveling the Ancient Seal. Actually putting two points into Ancient Seal. It's going to allow him to, you know, survive the magical damage, but it's going to allow it to return that damage. So maybe perhaps they will stop nuking him at that point. See Antares going up to potentially get a D ward off here. Looks like Solo is going to be the one that ends up claiming it. Oh, that actually rotated in. Flies rotated in. Lovely silence though from Antares, but Kiyotaka looks like he is definitely going to fall along with Solo here as well. The pulverize there first takes down the Pugna and double kill for the Sven. Very nice there indeed. This is what we're talking about when we consider like why. I'm wondering whether he goes to the level 10 magical resist talent because that will be really nice up against uh, Arkwarden and Skyrath. Gives 25 magic resist during trample. Oh, speaking of magic. Look at that magic burst on poor, poor Butterfly. Those, they do find themselves a kill. Almost top yet, the Ion Shell during the Song of the Siren. Yeah, might be able to get off a free freezing field in a lot of these fights as long as he's keeping track uh, of the Mars. Speaking of Mars though, he's going in on fly. Oh, he's being caught out. Yeah, Mystic Flare within the arena, along with that spear also. That is Fen decimated. Meanwhile though, Arc Warden attempting to take down the Primal Beast. Will be able to TP away, but in return, as the core, trying to take down the attacker there, has to act to move around with that Ace Rune. Already had that activated, actually. So it will be fine. And does not get away. I was about to say, barely gets away. Oh, even nicely done, uh, Lumain. Soaking up a little bit of that damage, using the blade melt to its full effect. We've also got the Ogre Axe, of course, to be able to make plays around. We do just have Guardian Greaves now on, as well on. on Pessimist. Oh, Arena is caught out as the core is deleted there by the Spark Raves, as well as Rue. Rue falls from an Arcane Bolt. So both of the supports down there and... Oh, Pogan has just shown himself solo. In trouble, what's fly? Oh, attention to try and get vision for the storm hammer. We'll get it. And the rest of the side of Yanolo some Marines flock in. They get the kill. Really? So it's just hanging around here, solo by name. Hold on, Butterfly. He needs to be very careful here. They might use the orchid and stuff onto him. They want to try and force out that BKB, but he's holding it for as long as possible. Until the last second. They will get solo, but Solo for a BKB use on your position one, not sure. 10 gold away from being able to pick that one up for himself. Also Dark has... Lord, Ooh. coming in for a scout, finds a race, Rue, oh, scouted out there. And will be taken out, easy peasy. Lord obtaining. Side of the map completely, they've only got the one Observer Ward down for themselves right now. And you can just see, you know, all of the illusions roaming around. Well, they're going for a race. Silence there. I mean, the blade mail activated does have the BKB. He's not going to commit it. Well, finally does. The Greaves are there, going to try and attempt to turn it around. They've killed Antares. 
but the BKB helping him go through that Song of the Siren will get that kill, but Arc Warden coming back alive the arena. Ready, it doesn't actually screw a hero here. Oh, look at the cleave! Look at Butterfly with the cleave! Finding themselves the Arc Warden, Arc Warden down the Naga. as Butterfly still laying in the damage. Triple kill for him. Make that an ultra kill as he goes on to pursue more. Give him the Rampage. There is the Storm Hammer. He wants to really get this and Torres slowing down the Grace. He's going for a freebie. He would love to oh, be able to him. pick He sees him. No, he doesn't. Oh, going the long way around. To give it up for free. Oh Man, my he not gosh, he's avoiding him in the chest. Oh, wait, there we go, there we go. He's got him. Pulverize there. Along with the onslaught as well. They'll get the kill with. Like using uh, Cinderbrew only igniting when you used fire spells. <laughs> that lasted for about a week until they were like, yeah, it's just too complicated. Oh, they found Naga. Oh, nice BKB. They've saved Pulverize. the Pulverize. Yeah. Yeah, they don't need Pulverize because your cores have got BKBs. Close the gap to make a, a vacuum a little bit more impactful or to drag whoever doesn't get hit by it into the range for a storm hammer or just some next level play like that. I mean, he just does the little things so well. As, uh, well, that's actually a really valuable spell that's stolen. The Nether Blast now, it's going to feel really good. Yeah. Oh, butterfly for Naga. That is a big item, especially against the Sven. We'll stop quite a bit of that physical damage coming out. Nine pandas. Want to try and find something here. They're going to try and catch themselves the darks here. They will do so indeed, but they're turning it around there with the BKB and the pulverizer. The to take down the Mars. Even with that BKB, it's not going to save you. Mars has been taken down. Meanwhile, on the sidelines here, we've got ourselves Butterfly trying to find Naga the damage again. here. On to Dark Lord, the Song of the Siren coming out. BKB, it's got around about three more seconds remaining and a massive crit there. The TP attempts now. Where's the cancel? <laughs> will not get it. Hides in the trees. Will be able to get that there successfully on the Nargut. And now they'll put... Going into the MKB next as well. Sees the butterfly. Oh, found themselves key attacker. Oh dear me. We found him. That BKB. I don't think it's going to help you. Onslaught there. Staying right underneath key attacker. Oh, oh nicely no, done no, Solo no, again. The save there from Solo. As meanwhile, Darks here in some trouble is found and they turn it around here on Nine Pandas. Lovely save there from Solo. Once again. Need to glyph just to be able to protect this tier 2 tower and. Well, is it even good? A race is going on an aggressive scout. He's going to find Antares there with the pulverize. As Frost bitten up. They will let the Skyraf go. Not saving that, they're, they're all split up here on Nine Pandas. Hearing a God's strength. Gonna try and chase the old partner. Harpoon. Oh, he's still butterfly, diving. Butterfly. Oh, he's been speared into the tower. He's still okay though. BKB is still ready. He's been hexed up. That's a lot of magical damage. The Mystic Flare comes out as well. Song of the Siren is there. He's been silenced up. He will be found. Still has Aegis the BKB. will bring him back alive. Yeah, he still has that BKB. But oh, he's been speared. Oh my god, lovely spear there from Alberca. Stopping the use there of that BKB as Stopping they cancel both. two TPs here from the supports as well. They found themselves ruined most potentially as the core as well. Locked in place there with the Glaive there. Goodbye as the core. That was. Um... And Naga Siren could still possibly get more items. You know, you, you've got a Song of the Siren to look to try and turn around if you want to get the shard just for a little bit of that healing. Yeah, see you, Solo. Okay, goodbye, Solo. Well, they got him eventually. That's. I mean, so, well, someone needs to go back. There's no backdoor protection inside the base, and you've got a siege creep wave there, and Kiyotaka, and Dentaris. And... All hacks! Mystic Flare! Oh my god! Yep. Butterfly decimated! With the Cypher Vice, he was not expecting that. They smoked below the low ground and just waited for him to pop out, and they decimated him. All the boys are inside the Roche pit as well, just waiting for it to respawn, but... Oh, oh. So there's the BKB, BKB being popped here. I mean, I don't know if you want to use the Pulverize just onto the Tempest Double. It was about to expire anyway. But yeah, I mean, if Sven's not there, you're not taking Roche, so there's no point in the rest of the team being down there on that side of the map, away from any kind of save potential. I mean, they don't have God Strength. God Strength on cooldown for 20 seconds, or even if he does buy back, he's not going to have it. X. The BKB forced out to Dark Lord Arena there. The Mystic Flare as well. Taking down this Darkseer. Look at the combination 
with this Mystic Flare every time the buyback from Sven is here now. The Song of the Siren comes out and this CM is definitely dead with all those Spark Rays. But King, oh, look at this butterfly with the God Strength takes down the Mars along with that clone there also. But then with the Tempest Double. Let a double do the work. Let the clone be the one soaking up a lot of the damage. Try and force out some of these big cooldowns if possible. Just using the crystal Dox clone. He's ready. Now. He's surging forward. He wants himself a vacuum. He's caught himself too. In comes the pulverized now. Sven able to activate the BKB along with the Ghost Trap as well. They take down the Naga Siren along with the Pugner as well. Now they're focusing right now. Albuquerque, he has himself that refresher. Healing all the way back up with thanks to that Satanic. Gonna spear away Butterfly attempting to flee. But he's been slowed down there by the Crystal Nova. The Stormhammer is there and they will find him. Lovely initiation there from Pessimist on the Darks here as they action alive and well. Could they catch the oh, real wait. Kiyotaka though? Oh. Oh. Maybe so, they have Vision coming forward. Uh-oh, Kiyotaka, the BKB, but the Pulverize is there. They will find the kill onto the Arc Warden. Down, down for 100. All right. They, they do should. have to rotate back though. Yeah, they just still want to hide his plans. It's going to be a little bit until he has the full Ag's plus the Ag's Blessing and the buyback. Uh-oh. They've caught a Darks here with no buyback. Uh-oh. Oh, wait. Yeah, okay, yeah, he's dead there. He's not getting out. To find him. He's around about 180 gold away from thought about it. Yeah, but then Techie says 250 do <laughs> 2 plus damage, so what are you going to do? Ooh, look at this cheeky smoke play coming out from Nine Pandas. Alberto, remember, he's, he's got the rapier. Yeah. He's on the high ground here, Once ready the with the arena. Sees Vision there on the Sven. Oh, lovely telekinesis from Rue! That was absolutely beautiful! Takes down the Mars. Oh, what a play! As now he comes back alive for the second time here. They're going to try and attempt to take him down there with the Pulverize if they get him. This is the Rapier with the BKB trying to get through there onto Albuquerque. The Son of the Siren is going to expire. The Dark's here, rooted into the arena. He will be found, but along with Dark Lord and Albuquerque! The Rapier on the ground. It is retrieved there by the Sven. Now he has a Rapier. He has his own Revenant Brooch on the Sven. Oh, they and proceeds the to throw. go for more. There we go. Finds the kill there onto Antares. And the buyback there from Albuquerque. It's a two millionaire coming out very soon. <laughs> everyone's got buyback as well. So I think everyone's pretty wealthy at this point. Uh, who's being caught out here? CM on the bottom side wouldn't want to just give this one up for free. Oh wait, the BKB, the Pulverize there, the BKB now from the Butterfly as well, trying to lay into Dark Lord, the Pulverize coming out again, will they be able to take down this Naga Siren? Yes, they will! But they do have themselves the Aegis in return, they do. I gotta be here for something. <laughs> exactly. Oh, oh good lord! Oh, Askador! Oh, it needs to go back to base. Absolutely Pooped his pants, activated that BKB faster than I've ever seen before. And the Book of Shadows as well. Oh, that's that's a all triple back. back. Onto three, charging in now, the Pulverize ready. But they haven't been able to get it off yet. Spear and Arena is there. Is so what's happening at the moment? Oh, that's a big God's Rebuke there. Erase is going to charge away. They find the kill down to Solo. Askador so low once again, though. The creeps were hitting into that tier four there, almost exposed. Kiyotaka now with this clone, attempting to try and find this Rax, only able to get it to around about three fourths of its HP remaining. And it'll slowly um, regen as well. Oof. Wait, they, are they going in for more here? I mean, they don't have themselves Arena. Aegis is going to expire in around about 10 seconds. Oh my god! The double Rapier God's Rebuke deletes the Darks here. From the Mars. Mars has queued up Boots of Travel here. Uh, really wanting the boots. It's got amplified damage. Oh! Erase! Lost half of his HP there from the amplified damage of the Mars. That is some scary That's stuff. Real now we've got ourselves a Ratting Arc Warden getting this into the distraction. The for the... Oh, Ancient Exposed. This is the this... distraction gaming that we've been talking about. Oh, They've still got the There's illusions available. everywhere. It's so mesmerizing. I... 
They need to take them out. Oh gosh, Mars coming One in hit. again. Not able to kill the Rubik. Attempting now to try and find this Mars. The pulverize is there. The song of the siren coming out. The freezing field with that BKB. It won't be disrupted. They're going to reset here. The spear does not connect there. Oh, a lovely back. There we go. Will they be kill able the to Mars. find the kill onto Mars? Mars will fall. Two rapiers Down on the deck. 120. Two rapiers. Dox is going to get a rapier, but they need to protect the ancient. The ancient is being protected. Rue is in some trouble. Uses the books of shadow there, but in comes Butterfly taking down Solo as Key Attacker just able to TP away right on top of Antares right now. Triple kill for the Sven, but all the buybacks, all of them, they're available for nine pandas. They have to be careful here. Nice she could put a deposit on a house with that much money. Yeah. She yoinked away the wisdom rune as well. Oh, they actually see oh, that it's the real one. Having to be a oh. little careful here on the primal. Oh, they've got themselves the arena there. And the massive nuke damage onto a rage. That takes him out. He's down for 100 seconds. Still actually got a, uh, a nether ward available. Might disrupt oh. a few plays. The creeps are slowly coming in. Rapier is back on Mars once again. They're Kiyotaka. going towards the ancient right now, but Butterfly coming forward instantly. Going to be able to find the kill there onto the Pugna, along with maybe perhaps Alberka as well. The Sun of the Siren just helping the to protect him, but in comes the Vac and the Wall of Repercore to two there, but Butterfly has been decimated there by the hands of Alberka. A dog here has to escape the ancient, slowly closing on death there. They're just able to protect it. The buyback here from both the Primal and the Sven. They're still in the game as the Pulverize comes out onto Solo. That is a dieback rapier on the floor as a second <laughs> rapier is in the hands of Astacor here. The defense of the ancients. This is literally what Yellow Submarines are doing here right now. They are having a crack of a time. I, I've, and when was the last time you saw Crystal Maiden have two rapiers and wanting to go for a date? Oh, then three, three together. Oh, the vac there and on oh, Torres. They're gonna try and get the ancient. The Mega Creeps, they need to protect that. There we go. Lovely stuff. They... See, they've left right it now. too long. Now now we have buybacks available on Primal Beast and Sven again. So I think it's literally just a charge into the Ancient. Oh, Solo. Oh, they forced out the God Strength. The Song Looking of the Siren has caught the Sven. Yeah, down there's here. meanwhile right by the Ancient, however. Oh, they've got the Pulverize there, but it's on a clone. Solo hiding within the trees. The Ancient is still alive. They do find the kill there onto Solo. A very interesting going in. initiation performed out here. It's just Antares they have left they the ancient. Yeah, they have left the Ancient exposed. They do go back to defend it. They do not want, actually, on, <laughs> on nine pandas to be able to potentially turn point. this around. I mean, the BKB stops in there, right? Sure, but he doesn't have it in his inventory Oh, Albuquerque! Right Albuquerque! Pulverize! They've caught the Mars! They've got a Mars! Is that another look at base? Look at base, look at base! Again? The base! They found oh, CM! Oh, CM! The Book of Shadows! They're laying into the Ancient! The Ancient is currently exposed! I mean, they did go true to Key Attacker's words. They did fight outside the base. That is that te technically true. The honorable thing to do. Technically true. Two they shot. found themselves solo. So two down, but a race is going to move back because of that shadow blade. Oh, yeah, the shadow blade went invisible. Oh, Dark oh, Lord has oh, just oh, ran into on, a race though. Oh, hold he's up, not hold holding up. on the gem. He's not holding Let the gem. Let him cook. Let him cook. Let him cook. Here we go. There's the hex and the instead. They may have found the kill onto the primal beast. They have primal beast dead. They did indeed cook. This arc warden, disgusting. Kiyotaka, responsible for ratting on Dota 2. Radiance Ancient is under attack with all of these Nagra illusions as they oh, make oh. a jump. They are going to solo. That is solo dead. Down for 100. And I mean, now they did they, use oof. the God Strength. Nearly ends up catching out on Tares there, but he's going to be able to blink out with the Arcane Blink. And now they're going to back out and not push forward because they don't have a Pugna. Although oh, they make a jump. to CM. Oh, CM dead! Triple Rapier. Bye back. They're going they're for the three. The they do have themselves the Glyph. The Pulverize comes out there. As Glyph? Dark Lord trying to hammer into it. They found themselves to Sven. The Glyph is there. They're trying to kill Dark Lord. As the Song of the Siren comes Kiyotaka's out. Kiyotaka's doing the it. The HNX exposed. There it is. They've got it. They end the game. No, we did not. We had ourselves a one hour I wish. and 31. <laughs> you wish a one hour and 31 minute game. Absolutely hectic.
but it was indeed all beast okay. again. So it, again, it's all one right. of those things that doesn't necessarily reveal exactly where. Intriguing, yeah. I mean, he's 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 got a claymore. What does uh, he's got a claymore in his quick buy? So yeah, he's probably going crystalis straight after. As they do find the kill there. On oh, not having a. Particularly nice time with the harass. Meanwhile, top lane though, Sticky Bomb along with the blast off as well. Attempted to try and find the kill down to Dark Lord. Heals up there with the magic wand and turns it around. Ooh. Meanwhile, on the bottom lane, they do find the kill finally onto that pesky Enchantress. They will win spawns. Oh, denies it though. Very nice from Antares. Not able to get the chat cram further enough though to reach the Crystal Maiden. Frostbite comes out. The Astral Imprisonment is ready. Never mind. They will commit the Sanity's Eclipse instead. I'll also get rid of the uh, the observer ward around that mid lane. So mana reduced by one thousand one hundred ninety four. <laughs> Why doesn't see right? You never know. Oh, Dark Lord. The, uh, the onslaught. That's big. And with the track run, blast off onto two. They find the kill onto the gyrocopter rotation coming in for the crystal maiden. At least we'll find a return kill there, but they may find more on the side here. Of Yellow Submarine, and they do. Level six now. Pulverize comes out, finds the crystal maiden. Same sort of thing with the Timber Saw. So early on, you've got the four staff. You can use it onto the target of the Pulverize and actually just break it all together. So it's a oh, nice Proto. That's a kill. Yeah. Erase nice. cleans it up there with the will. Perhaps they're going to try and go here onto OD. Blast off with the Sticky Bomb as well. Can Erase catch up with the Chakram? Yes, he can. Another Sticky Bomb coming out. Solo rotating in though with the heals. And now they're turning it back around with the Frostbite and the Freezing Field. Sanity's Eclipse gains the kill, but in comes a big Primal Beast charging through. Here comes Butterfly, also really wanted to try and get himself a Chrono, but they have just been able to pull. Yeah. They do have the blink, though, on Mars. They finally got that now, so now they have an opportunity to get themselves an arena. Key Attacker is going to join in, and here we come. Oh, Spear! into an arena mid chrono what timing that was as butterfly now is found by the astral imprisonment as they loop to try and get themselves the enchantress here too will be skewered to the tree double kill for kyo taka what a coin i i i stuff oh can they onslaught in the are they gonna get they there know. in time they know it's oh, coming the Roshan slowly falling go on are they gonna charge in the ages is there the onslaught still will no the onslaught oh, didn't work! Stopped. He stopped. And the imprisonment there as well. The BKB activated there from a race. They find Askador along with Rue 2. They've lost themselves too on the side of Yellow Submarine. Make that free. OD able to survive through it all with thanks to the heals there from Solo. Triple kill for Kiyotaka. Not able to get off the chrono there. Safely here as Dark Lord. He's around about 400 got away for a BKB. They're actually going to go for a race here. He doesn't have himself a BKB. It's on cooldown. So if they catch him right now, it's going to be big. Lovely arena stops Destroys the trees the from using the timber chain. Beautiful stuff there from Albuca. As meanwhile, Kiyotaka finding himself the faceless void, but able to activate that BKB and getting themselves back. And Tarez leading though. Frostbite onto timber. Does have the BKB in case they do decide to jump upon him. Couple of supports uh, that were able to get that action done. Charging in here, got themselves solo maybe. The Glimmer Cape is there. The pulverize all oh, onto the OD. That's big, but oh, a lovely Sanity's Eclipse. And now the Chrono comes out. The BKB is there from Butterfly, but he's taking just way too much damage. The Agnim saves Kiyotaka. They lose themselves three. As the tip comes out onto the Faceless Void, he was able to get around about 820 physical damage against the faceless with just the flat cannon alone and dealt some other damage also so that's where all his hp went they found themselves the primal here on the bottom lane way too long you lose a full lane of racks while you're spending Whoa. this time moving i still I mean, see, see where the, the cod solo. and it come the chrono is ready they're attempting to try and get solo there they will get it BKB activated here on the faces. They'll attempt to try and take down the gyro now whilst he has this Aegis because the BKB was committed. The Satanic, Satanic is, is there. Not healing very much here, but the Spear connected the faceless void. Oh, and the Sanity's Eclipse deletes the faceless. Buyback from both the Primal and the faceless. They want to come back to this fight here. Chrono Spear is still available. He comes forward. He's been able to three. Chrono 3 here. He's going to go for the Crystal Maiden along with the Gyrocopter here as well. Gyro dead. The Aegis going to bring 
bring him back alive as the Faithless able to time walk back his HP. Key attacker has no more mana remaining, but is still in this fight with thanks to that Agnims, keeping him afloat as they will find the Primal there too. It's a dieback. Timber remaining, trying to run away, but Key attacker just got all of his mana back with thanks to the Essence Flux. And he's just going to Ooh. delete almost the faceless void there. Trying it to already. escape. GG is called. There we go. That is a much faster paced game. 33 minutes in. And game two is going to nine pandas. Much more convincing. And I mean, the net worth was heavily in the yellow submarine favor for the first, what, 15 or a little bit of chaos in the middle of these team fights. Do have to say on the primal. Really needing to style gameplay coming through, you know, blink skewer into the RP, into the torrent, into, you know, some freezing field eclipse damage coming through. It does leave them a little bit. Oh, hold on, this would be a good start if they're able to get the first kill onto the position one. And Dark Lord, not the start oh, that he'd be wanting. First blood. Ooh, connects on to no. I was about to say half the wave. We just see what happens, right? You really need to make a tough decision, and it's not like there's oh. a correct answer either. The, the may have caught Butterfly here. Will they dive the tier one tower? Mm, they were thinking about it, but now they have to go back because there's a rotation in from Rue. Finds the kill onto Albuquerque, but in return, as Decor will fall to the tier one tower, but is not able to get any CS here. Meanwhile, they may have killed themselves Batrider with a Telekinesis and a Frostbite, and they will do so indeed. Been a little bit too aggressive, wants to try get the Luna there, but a TP rotation in and Rubik staying here. From Rue, of course. Man, you said I had three strikes, but he is playing the Rubik once again, and, uh, oh, you know, that's two. If you're uh, if you're not making anything happen on the top side for your Magnus, who still might end up getting solo killed by solo. Oh, the zombies! Oh, oh decay doesn't hit. Out. Fade bolt. Maybe. No matter. I mean, no matter on decay. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, all the skewer misses. Maybe man fight. No, enough mana. Enough mana for a decay. In t no, needed needed ten mana. Went a little bit early with the magic stick usage. Had one uh, one stick charge after the fact. Might have been able to turn that one around, but not the case. I mean, at the end of the day, he still is going to uh, to get the full HP and mana back. So not the worst for him. Avoids a trip all the. Mm -hmm. They're just going to keep him there now. Radiant structures. Are Solo's actually trying to bring him creeps. <laughs> He's going to get skewered. What a support! He'll get taken out. Oh, th th this, is, this is not a position you want to be. I mean, do you have at least flying career? Yep, it's a missile. And attempt to TP now. No, no has no. a TP yet. Kiyotaka's going real deep, and it's the real they Kiyotaka as well. Yeah, look, they rotate it. They rotate the camera. Oh, they nearly they put him up as well. Could Kiyotaka there He as didn't well. have a TP either. Imagine if they oh. could just keep them stuck up there. Literally, all you would need to do is just keep Rubik nearby, and there's nothing that they can do. Wait, that, that's not a TP. That's a band of elven skin on the uh, the gyro courier. Okay, now, now there's some room. There's some room for gyro to breathe. TP is there. Okay, the gyro is out. Gyro is safe. So meanwhile, this is a big contest here on the triangle. Meanwhile, big boat coming in, affecting Kiyotaka. TP now from a race. Where's the TP cancel? There it is with the lasso. There's a race trying to find Kiyotaka there, but we'll be taken out there. <sighs> Classic core players ruining the farm, stealing the farm on Alberca. I mean, to be honest, even though Gyrocopter got uh, got Cliff there, did um, oh my gosh, they found Magnus all the way up there as well. His net worth's not that bad. I mean, second in which he has. I mean, Antares building up stacks for himself. He's level six. Obviously, just used the primal split to be able to get the boat kill. Boat again, a double boat. There's a race getting lower and lower. Has to be very careful there. Solo taking a lot of damage there from the Tybringer, but so still manly. manning up as they find the kill to the Crystal Maiden. The Fade Ball in return, finding the Undying. X Marx is going to bring back Antares. Does not have himself the Primal Split. Maybe perhaps no. Decay on cooldown there for Rue. So. Coming up top was just a bit of a blip on the radar, though, for Nine Pandas. It was a 6 and 1 kill score. 
favor of Yellow Submarine, and it's very quickly gone back oh, to no, Astacor. Oh, he yeah. just got deleted there. Yeah, the, the power of Arc Warden on this dire side. Yep. Primal Split's already back up again. They're just three tower here on the bottom. Just going to rotate top. Is attempting to farm up. Midas is here now, so he can start to recover They're the in. levels. Just meanwhile, oh my gosh, look at Erase oh, just deleted everything. there. What can you do? Absolutely everything. I mean, they could have just gone all in and taken the tower. You know, you've got Kiyotaka, right? Playing the R. So, Yellow Submarines, they are on a timing here. They need to make their actions count. I mean, a race coming here with the Tauren. Oh, it doesn't catch the Arc Warden. the real one. But they're bringing in the boat. The Primal Split is here. It's the Eclipse also coming out. And Arc Warden. Still alive here for the time being. Astacor taking huge amounts Ooh, of nice damage. Nice Phantom. Skewer. An RP, but it only connects there onto Solo. The Arc Warden and the Batrider completely fine. A big Tidebringer there, but nonetheless, they've lost themselves two. Lost themselves three. Complete disaster here for Yellow Submarines. They lose four. It's possible. Prevent Yellow Submarine from making any plays of their own. They've got a Blink Dagger. Maybe they'll be, yep, able to get a Skewer back onto a target. These are the pickoffs that you're wanting to get. Just free pickoffs. Not wanting to uh, overcommit too much at this stage. The Brewmaster pre split or Ooh. actually look to focus. They go for the Twin Gate here. They may find Dark Lord because they can see the creeps. There's no creeps here, which signifies there we go. The smoke's broken. Finding themselves the gyro. Nice pickoff here. This should definitely be a kill. There it is. The boat comes in. A race finds the gyro copter. So nice pickoff there. The hands of Kiyotaka. So, it's very annoying hero currently at the moment within these team fights. They're actually going to smoke into this and go head on. They are not scared. I don't think they'll realize this. Nine pandas. Oh, the horn toss. Oh, miss. It misses. That's not good. They're going to try and take advantage of this now, nine pandas. Come forward. Can they catch someone? Nothing big was expended, though, and a quick pick onto Solo would be ideal. He already used the tombstone. Yeah, they, they got the kill there onto Solo. Homing missile, though, will affect Butterfly with that. Nine Pandas, they will do a soft retreat here. They're still hanging around. X Marks is going to bring back Dark Lord. He doesn't have himself the BKB, the RP? Eclipse, and the RP. Oh, the RP was cancelled by the lasso. But nonetheless, the damage is enough there from the Eclipse of Butterfly to take down the rest of Nine Pandas. And Luca, that a complete turnaround here. This Butterfly just has way too much damage, and it's a team wide. Danok, a team wipe from Yellow Submarines. It Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Oh, Magnus, moving forward. Nice horn toss, bringing back the Brewmaster. And doesn't have the primal split. It was on cooldown there. You can possibly, you know, jump in and get an RP. I, I, I'm sure Nine Pandas will split themselves up, not allow them to get a uh, a big RP here. And if actually, oh, nice reactions there from Rue. Blinking away. Xbox now onto Dark Lord. He'll be brought back there. Torrented up. Taking Gyro. a lot of damage there. That was from the Condor. Eclipse now. RP committed down to Kiyotaka. Kiyotaka's dead. As Dark Lord now attempting to flee with the BKB. Not helping him at all whatsoever. They've lost themselves two on nine pandas as they retreat. High ground wards that they're playing around with. Solo actually goes ahead and buys the gem. And he's going to walk into the torrent, so he has to be a little bit careful of getting picked off once again. Looks like the team has just resigned themselves to the fact that Solo is going to die. Did he just save himself him. with his own tombstone? Oh, wow, well, okay, he did. Lasso Skull comes Nassar. out, but the physical damage too much for Albuca there to handle. An RP, it does come out there, connects onto two. They found themselves the Batrider there, Dark Lord again, taking so much damage. He really needs it. Satanic is the stolen lasso. Finds the gyrocopter. They lose four here. Kiyotaka falls once again, and it's only the Brewmaster who remains, who is going to be revealed here as there's the skewer bringing him back out of the base. The Magnus, is he going to survive? No, the Cinderbrew will actually take him down here, but so will Antares fall as they find themselves a team wipe. Once again, only losing the Magnus and the CM. They can just push high ground here now. Can uh, try and scout forward. Yeah, they, they know Kiyotak is there now. But they do have a really nice Observer Ward here. They can see them heading into the Roshan. They have huge advantage here with Vision, but that has just been denied. 
And oh, they found themselves solo. Uh oh. Taken out there with the Condit. I you got it, yeah. Mm, I much I prefer this if they just go the full on retreat. I don't think you could fight into this. No. Once they, again, need to be the being the one. Oh, they have caught themselves the Magnus. But they have got themselves the Aegis as a stolen lasso! Cool Kiyotaka pulls him into the Roshan pit, who is absolutely decimated, along with Alberka as well, as they got themselves the RP onto the Gyrocopter, thrown up in the air by the Torrent. Disaster of a team fight for Nine Pandas. Only Antares survives. He's well, going to find the, the kill, kill but there. Yeah, onto I mean, this. Yeah. He just popped the, the, uh, the split, though, right? Like... He is a support, and it doesn't feel very supporty at this point in the game, you know? He's the cores are dying around him, Roshan's going down, and... Rank 2 at the end of the day, surely, you know, if you're rank 2, you don't make that many mistakes. Oh no, Solo, he got caught again! Uh-oh. Yes, he has. Although, we got ourselves the lasso there, but there's no follow-up. Cancel of the TP, though, onto a race. There's been flame nice, break to the low ground. They do find the kill onto Kunker. Though we do have ourselves Butterfly, who is completely solo here right now. Where's the rest of his team? They're not there. Oh, He's in some trouble. They're going to buy back for this. They want to try and turn this fight back around because if they get this Luna, the game, the momentum, it could change. Is Luna going to be back alive? Has the BKB available? And look at that damage being dealt there to the Gyrocopter. Dark Lord has to back himself up. The Madness is here now, but he's been put in place there by the Glatonir. Now in comes the Eclipse, going to find Solo. Solo will fall there by the Lucent Beam, as we do have ourselves Butterfly, who is still alive. And oh my gosh, Alpaca, so low. Just one more attack is needed. Oh, oh, the Blink, just able to blink away. Oh, stuff's the wrong way. Capabilities to save himself with the uh, with the grab ally. Oh, they're smoking up. Oh, what? That what? But that was blind. That was blind. They got themselves the brew, but he's going to buy back instantaneous there. But the damage coming out from Luna is way they too much for Kiyotaka to handle. As Dark Lord found here also by the Luna, absolute carnage. As now we do have ourselves Butterfly attempting to flee, but an RP! Oh, it's caught them all! Oh, Dark Lord is dead, along with the brew as well. Bye back here from Kiyotaka. GG is called Game 3. We'll be going here to Yellow Submarines as Nine Pandas. They will not get the victory this game. This series still goes on here. Yellow Submarines, they will get themselves Game 3 here. We are going to a Game 4. Take a uh, All right, what are you wanting to have with this centaur? Just something to hold him in order to uh, just stay out on the map. Someone to build a bonus 100 attack range that you get once you pick up that Aghanim shard. They're running yeah. into each other here, both under vision, by the way. Nine pandas have been very disciplined to not reveal that they know exactly what's going on. I think the they want to try and get begins. that surprise go on on the back lines. Here we go, Dark Lord's going in. Oh, Stormhammer onto two. The Blood Grenade being committed there. Rue will most likely fall, yes. Rue's gone, along with the Centaur too. And indeed, you were right, Danov, just baiting there with that Observer. I mean, they have the Observer up there themselves. But that healing self used will have to definitely go to base. Meanwhile, on the bottom lane, they have found themselves Butterfly with that Blood Grenade. Antares committing the level two Fade Bolt. And that was just with a level 1 Dragon Tail. No brief fire, though. I'll get the kill on the carry. There's now maybe perhaps no Centaur fire. as well in the top lane. Oh. Disruption Dark Lord. His, uh, mm -hmm. his healing self is no more. Yeah, his presence here has been really valuable. Action, Action bottom. <laughs> Sorry, Danok. They get themselves right. Rubik. With a blast off <laughs> there and a Blood Grenade. Oh. Action's never so, ended. Result in it, unfortunately. It's completely out of mana. On the back of that aggressive attempt, they need to push all the way back. It's about to get okay. those arcane boots though soon. Oh, there's the ult. There we yeah. go. Communicated that. Gets the kill onto Life Stealer. Mm. Happy days for Kiyotaka. Also gives them a bunch of valuable information. Getting up with thanks to the Dragon's Blood. Okay, oh, and Torres may die here from the level 3 Sticky Bomb. And will do so indeed with the final physical attack from Astacor. They're just killing people instead. <laughs> there we go. Lane shoved in, forced to defend. Can't contest the power rune. Oh, blast off lands. Albuquerque. Oh, that's a lot of damage. 
A lot of damage, that Whirling Death level 4, with help from the Blast Off and the Proximity Mines. That is an easy kill picked up there onto the DK here with a Storm Hammer, just in order yeah. to secure the kill, because he does have Stampede, so he can just utilize that and move away, but they can steal it. There it is. They will steal the Stampede. Attempted TP will be cancelled there by the Storm nice Hammer. Very nicely played there by Nan. And yeah, deliberately waiting until after... He's okay. Yoinking away a little bit of the farm that they've built up. Solo actually ended up walking into it, but the Ooh, stack's stolen gone. Stampede. Yeah. Rue is definitely dead there. Finding an easy kill. Onto the Pugnet. But you can see the pings immediately going out here. Solo wants to play around mid. He wants to play with the boys. That's for a little bit of damage, but also just to scout out as Rubik might still get- Oh my gosh! Okay, the nuke damage there from a race is shown. I've never seen this type of Zeus actually work. I mean, out of all the games I've seen, I, I don't think we've come to see it. But uh, an attempt at Albuquerque's life. They will find Antares, maybe perhaps. Sticky Bomb slowing him down. Yeah, they find the kill. Although, yeah. Understanding, right? Because both of them do need to be that oh, chaos creator. Yeah, the infest is inside oh, as well. Oh, they've just seen the Zeus. Zeus is going to reveal himself to the lane. Uh-oh. In comes the stomp. And the infest, that is Kiyotaka dead. Five-man gank upon the Zeus, taking down the Zeus. And now the Stampede coming out there. Dark Lord activating that God Strength. The race getting very low. Lovely Dragon Tail there from Albuca. Can they find the kill? Lovely disruption. But Stormhammer off cooldown. They still find the kill nonetheless. The BKB, nice BKB. there. And pursuing the Centaur. They pick themselves up two kills. So at least they avenge Kiyotaka here. They may find themselves a third. It's coming up. Oh, uh, lovely Dragon's Tail. Can they get the Stormhammer as well? Uh oh, oh no. they found four. Oh, dear. That is not what Yellow Submarines wanted. I wonder why they were hanging around there for a while. They Tips thought he could as well. Fight. He thought he could van fight. He thought, you know what? I've got the rage. I'm able to go into it. But he just doesn't there to be farmed. I'd love to take out that Timber's courier. It's holding on to the components of the Octarine Core, but they would rather take out the Timber Ooh, himself instead. Him. Yeah, there's the Stormhammer. Oh, lots of damage there. Attempting to stop the Sven, but the Dragon Tail comes out. Dark Lord is back. Finds the Shadow Demon there too. Into the game. Going for the Bloodthorn next, which, you know, quite like. It's all about taking out that uh, that Lifestealer to be able to start things off. If you do that, then Zeus simply becomes a whole lot more impactful in a lot of these fights. You're not worried about just getting run at. While well, they're rotating in here, Arrays, he's, he's kind of on his own here. I mean, Found Rue him. is close by, but the Orchid is there. The God Strength comes out. Yeah, Rue can definitely not save that Timber Saw as the Dragon Tail also casted upon the Shadow Demon. He will use the Glimmer Cape and attempt to TP away here within the trees, but a lovely sentry revealing that TP. He stops there with a the Telekinesis. They will find two. They even can for the next little bit. Could pop the BKB, could try and two shot the Life Stealer with that Orchid on the back of him. Centaur, Stampede ready, coming forward with the Hoof Stomp there, going to try and attempt to take down Albuquerque there with the Blast Off also. God Strength comes out in return along with the BKB, also they will find the Dragon Knight and Stampede actually able to allow them to disengage, but not Butterfly being found there by the hands of Dark Lord and Kiyotaka. So they get themselves two, possibly three, telekinesing back the Centaur, who's trying to attempt to run away here within the trees, but in comes a race with the insane new damage, and healed up there by Solo. That Aegis has expired, has to be careful. They will lose the tier three, but they'll keep it. You can see he's been forced to go for the, uh, oh. the BKB as well. Uh-oh. What's flies on his own? He has to commit the rage. They have vision of Rue as the Stampede Rue's just like, take me out. instead. Dragon Tail, it's caught. The life stealer, butterfly. He doesn't have rage. Three more seconds. TP is on cooldown. The silence is there. Can he get away? Oh, no, he on. cannot. The dragon tail comes out once again. The rage is there. Not able to toggle the armlet. The damage is way too much for him to handle, and he is down for a minute. From the elder dragon form, that all it really feels like they're waiting for. This is a bit of a hail mary Ooh. play. I mean, if they die, they die because they have no buybacks available. But they're going to go for the initiation here. Oh! What a disruption! Oh no! That disruption there, save there from Antares. There's now the God Strength coming out there, but thankfully with the slow of the demonic purge, that onto Dark Lord is going to stop him from pursuing. 
As now they do find themselves a Dragon Tail again. BKB is there. King trying to heal back up, but the damage from Dark Lord is just too much. Butterfly falls. As the BKB also on Centaur, trying to utilize as much of it as he can, but that will now expire. Potentially just clean up this base. I mean, Erase is full HP. Has the blink ready? Can he try something here? They come forward with another oh, Dragon Tail there kick again. Onto the They're attempting Demon. to try and take down Rue. Rue has actually been able to heal up here and is attempting to get away with the thanks to the Glimmer Cape, but they've lost themselves the Techies. Techies down. Buyback is available though for Astacore as they still lay into this middle set of racks. They will find it. Look at the dragons. They're just oh, going everywhere. Gosh. Popping all of those mines that they've got set up. Lifesteal are having to use the rage just to try and move out the tiniest amount. And they're still losing their axe as a result of everything else. We've got Let's nine handers playing Game of Thrones here by throwing in all the dragons. Oh, Lovely dragon tail nine. there. But a disruption save coming out from Rue. As Butterfly, okay, a Good lovely jump. hoof stomp there, and Torres dead, along with the Pugna also, key attack, a lovely, no, he dies! Oh, lovely stuff from a raise, yeah, I thought he was going to TP away. <laughs> I forgot the word for mines. Mm -hmm. Alberka, he wants the jump onto Lifestealer. Not going to get it, just to use the real body. Oh, he's just and... taking the rage racks, and he is out of there. The damage over time ends up doing it, just from the corrosive breath. Dragon Tail being so annoying. Oh, Dark Lord wants to go in. God Strength activated. As they come forward there with the Stampede, they want to try and fight Key Attacker, getting very low Solo. again. Just able to escape. Dark Lord now laying in the damage. They've killed Solo. Solo going to try and turn back, but Butterfly actually being able to heal up here by hitting through the Sven. Dark Lord in trouble. Oh, the save from the Telekinesis. He's been able to escape, but never mind the Blink there. Coming out from Centaur. Double kill. Taking down the Sven. Look at this now. Yellow submarines, they're turning around, but Rubik trying to get the Mega Creeps. He's gonna get it, and Torres, you cheeky boy, blinking in the back, able to find the melee racks, and the Megas are now coming towards. That's sort of. Well, they're hanging around. This is a. Uh... Oh, wow, look at this. Oh, Albuquerque. Butterfly, butterfly, careful, careful. Albuquerque. Coming Who's forward, God Strength has been activated. Blast off there, going to jump to the other side of the Roche pit. Albuquerque, because of that Double free bombing, oh, they're actually going to go onto the Sven here. Sven may be in trouble. The BKB there, along He's with disarmed. the from the Satanic, but he has been disarmed there. As Timbersaw coming in now, as all oh, nice dealer popping back out. The Stampede is there. The buyback from Techies. They found Solo. Solo dead. As they want more, Key Attacker being slowed down here by the open wounds. They're going to go forward onto the Zeus. That's Zeus dead. Two down. As Sven, where is he? He's hanging around here. He's going to try and TP away. Where's the castle? There it is with the roof stop. How does this happen? How? How? They're still lurking around here, Nine Pandas. They don't want to show themselves. They're just letting the illusions push. The race having to handle the creeps. Although they Long have found themselves solo. But no detection. Stampede comes out now, really wants to try and find Solo here. They will get the kill. Erase TPing in there with the boots. But the creeps <laughs> are at the tier fours right now. I don't know if that Observer Ward quite clipped him. Pessimist. Still hanging around. Oh, they know. Perhaps they know. Yeah, they know, they know Dragon Knight's there. Lovely hoof stomp. There we go. Dragon Knight in some trouble. Does have himself the BKB, but taking way too much damage. And will be found down for 100 seconds. But... I wonder yeah, if he's going to trade in his lens. boots. Oh, oh wait, oh, the teams please. may meet here. Oh, they found themselves the Centaur. As Dark Lord going in with the Blood Ford there, the BKB and the Infest there. The Centaur will be fine for some time. They found themselves on Torres. Trying to go for Dark Lord here, but they don't have themselves the detection. As meanwhile, Solo is found there by the Chakram. They take down both the Techies and the Shadow Demon. As Dark Lord coming back in here with the God Strength of Rays, attempting to flee along with Butterfly. Also using that BKB, TPing away. But a Rays has been found. Slowed down here heavily. Will eat the cheese. Hexed up there. Nowhere to run. Will be taken out. Buybacks are available. You're going to need to use them just for the fact that they want to go for a Dragon Tail attempt here again. Onto Butterfly, possibly. It's on the front lines Split. here. No BKB available on this life stealer. Slowly pushing in. Look at these tier four towers. They're just melting here from the illusions. Oh my lord! Life stealer taking a lot of damage there. The stampede will be committed. Trying to find now some more pick off kills here against nine pandas. Solo will survive. The Zeus will TP away. They may just disengage here with only losing the supports. 
There's Solo dying. They forced out a buyback there. Age is still remaining on the DK. No BKB on the Centaur, no Stampede on the Centaur. Nothing else was popped though, and you still have that Divine Rapier to be able to make these plays. Shattered oh, they're pushing in Albuquerque. He's getting really cocky now, taking the lead. Forces out the Rage there on Butterfly. Dark Lord ready. Oh, well, they get themselves the Dragon Tail there onto Lifesteal. A lovely save is able to keep the life stealer alive. Now attempting to heal back up is actually going to infest the Dragon Knight there. The Dragon Knight being slowed down by the Demonic Push. They will take down the DK as now they proceed to try and find Antares. But Dark Lord with the God Strength trying to lay through here into the life stealer. But the life stealer, he's holding Butterfly. The blast off is there, but he doesn't have his off his rage anymore. But it doesn't matter because look at Sven. Sven is going to fall. The Mega Creeps slowly hitting the Ancient right now. They need to take down this DK. Okay, they will, they lose four. They still hold that on. It looks like we're going to go for a second one hour game. Just gets himself um, four rapiers to amplify his magic damage by 100%. Uh, oh, they found the Pugda. And and oh, they have found a Pugda. Pugda dead. But they may, they may go for the ambush here. They're attempting to get all oh, lovely BKB there from Butterfly. But they need to get themselves back here on the side of Yellow Submarines because they found them. Oh, a lovely disruption there. But they'll still find the Techies. Techies down. Buyback from the Techies. They need to stop these creeps. Initiate back in here until that is back online. So they're just going to stop pressuring the lanes here. I think they might. I think they'll have about a 20 second window where you've got the Elder Dragon form, but you don't have the BKB on the Lifestealer. It's actually about 25 seconds. So, oh, this could be a die back. In. As they jump onto the Techies there, Techies will fall down for 120, but they jump forward there. They found themselves the Sven and the DK too. DK down. Aegis will bring him back. Will they be able to save him as the storm comes out? But never mind, the BKB is there and the Telekinesis with the four staff boots. Look at him go. He is out of there. All right, so he's got. 7.6k HP, and that's prior to him hitting any sort of double edge as well, which they, with the shard, he's like stealing it. Oh, they make a solo here. Solo's gonna reveal himself. Yeah, there's the hex. And they've got an easy kill. Die back. DK's coming though. Uh-oh. Nimbus? Nimbus? Oh, it's gonna TP out. Centaur in trouble. Gonna use the BKB and the Stampede with that unobscured pathing, but DK also has unobscured pathing. Gonna follow head. They find the Centaur. Is it worth it though for Solo? Well, how'd you get him? He's sitting all the way in the back. Oh wait, 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 wait. have they just found a raise? Uh oh. Hex up. Buyback is available though for the timber sort. That is a dead timber. Being caught out there by the hands. Hey though. Has the rage ready? Laying into the ancient right now. As Lifesteal, it did use the infest there just now. It's, all, it's it's got a quick cooldown though. Back off in 15 seconds. The BKB is available. Good Centaur coming in, but look at this. We have ourselves Dark Lord attempting to try and kill the ancient. The glyph is forced out. They'll try and find the Sven now. Sven has been taken down. Down 400 will not commit the buyback. They lose the DK as well. The glyph was forced. And a buyback also. It's a 75 minute shenanigan. They, they are going to go for the throne here. They're clear. They've done really, really well pushing out the wave here. It's now a race is going to join. They're going to go for the end here. Look at this. Did the buybacks are available here. This is now or never. As the Thunder God's Wrath, it comes out there. The Dragon Tail forward there onto the Techies. But they're going to try and attempt to turn it around here. Bashing up the DK has been saved there by the Telekinesis. Solo gets four snapped away as well. A race getting super low. They found themselves the Centaur. If Centaur dies here, it could be BKB game. In two. As BKB they found themselves the Dark Lord. Dark Lord attempts to get away here also. As look at this butterfly attempting to flee. Does not have himself the BKB or the Enrage. Erase, it's dangerous erase. here. It's dangerous for Yellow Submarines. They find themselves the Life Stealer. Safe there by the disruption. The Centaur. Is he going to be found? Yes, he is. Life Stealer dead. Along with the Techies also. Centaur gone. The buyback there from Life Stealer. Attempting to try and come That's back it. to the fight. They've lost themselves. The Timber Saw. It definitely looks to be game now. Only two remaining. Yes, there it is, ladies and gentlemen. We are not going for a game five. Game four. It's not GG. It's called. They will be your champions that head on towards the Elite League. They quite